the J Hook Magic. I'm Jess. Thank you so much for coming and stumbling along my channel and wanting to hang out with me. I truly appreciate it. If you are new here, welcome, welcome. How art thou? How art thou? I hope all is well. And if you haven't already and you would be so, so kind, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know when new videos have been posted. If it's not your first time here, welcome back my yarny friends so excited you are here so this is scrubby sunday on a monday <laughs> um i am following along with uh heather from strings and threads and a bunch of different uh youtube creators um heather used to well not used to she does <laughs> uh a segment called uh scrubby sunday and she would make different um, washcloths, dishcloths. Um, she would, uh, use that to work on her knitting or do some crochet patterns. Um, she was reached out to, um, make some of those washcloths for, uh, the, this organization called the American Starfish, which helps out homeless, uh, vets, which is amazing. So she put a call out to us to help her fulfill this, um, order project wonderful gesture <laughs> call it what you may uh so a bunch of us have jumped on it and as soon as i heard that i was like yes i want to be a part of it um this was supposed to be filmed yesterday but i have been suffering a migraine for the last three days it's still killing me it's like right over here uh so but we will get through this so this is my scrubby sunday on a monday <laughs> Um, so I figured, uh, oh, before I get into all that, I just want to let you know that in the description box, I will have, um, everybody who is joining along and working on the Scrubby Sunday washcloths. Uh, so go check them out, give them a like and subscribe and see what kind of washcloths they're make, uh, donating. And uh, if you would like to join along, please do. If you have a channel, let us know so we can add you. If not, if you want to send us a picture and we can put your picture uh, in our videos. Or if you don't want anyone to know and you just want to send it in, I will have the uh, email address. Oh, not, not email. I will have the mailing address uh, to where to send your donation. So any little bit helps. Uh, and this will be going on until November 11th. So you have plenty of times to do some uh, little projects to get done in the middle of your big projects. So with this, um, I was like, ooh, I don't knit. <laughs> and I don't think I ever will. I don't know. Knitting scares me. I was like, I could work on my uh, Tunisian. I have a bunch of Tunisian hooks and I'm like, let's work on some Tunisian. That's kind of like knit. It's like, you know, a mixture. So the first one, <laughs> I was not paying attention and I kept putting it down and picking up, putting down, picking up because I was in the middle of doing stuff. So I was not paying attention and I just happened to look at it and I was like, what happened? <laughs> it, it this side's not too bad but this side I don't know somehow I lost some stitches gained some stitches this was doing a Tunisian with a five millimeter hook Tunisian hook uh doing the simple stitch so I just cut it off and I was like ah okay put that aside <laughs> Let's sit down and try this again. So I sat down, paid more attention, and I got this beautiful washcloth. I don't know what happened here in the middle. Or maybe it was just the way it was lying. Maybe it's just, okay. Anyway, so I did uh, this one, and this is all done in cotton yarn, um, sugar and cream, peaches and cream. I think some are sugar and cream, some are peaches and cream, but it's all 100% cotton. Um, 
This is the simple stitch. Here's the back. That's the front. And this is Tunisian simple stitch. And then I just did a uh, single crochet with a crochet hook to make like a border around it just to finish it up a little bit. And the bottom was like curling some. So did that. Um, that took a lot longer than I expected. <laughs> I didn't expect it to take that long. Um, it's fun. It's different. It did hurt like my wrist and my hand right here. Um, cause you know, you have to, let me see. This is the hook I used. And, um, cause you kind of have to hold it. And then you're going through because you don't turn or nothing. You go one way and then you pull out and then you go. So it's all like this. And then you have like, you have to hold the yarn here and I don't know. So I was like, oh, that took me so long. Well, first I messed up <laughs> and then that one took me a little long. So I'm like, okay, I need to give that a break. So I then did this one. And this is done in um, a lemon peel stitch, or some people call it a grit. Is it grit? Grit? Grit stitch? I don't remember. <laughs> but I call it the lemon peel stitch. Granite? Is it granite? No. Oh, I'm drawing a blank here. You guys know what I mean. It's, um, you do like double crochet, single crochet, double crochet, single crochet. And then the next row you do the opposite of whatever it is. And it makes this really cool stitch. I did this with a 5.5 crochet hook and I love it. Oh my God. Look, it matches my shirt. I just seen that. <laughs> Thought I put a little pop of color in. Normally I just wear grays and black. So I found this shirt and I was like, Ooh, let's put a pop of color in. So, uh, <laughs> so I got this one done and that's all I have done so far because <laughs> this headache is killing me. Um, but I plan on making more. I think I'm going to do more of that lemon peel stitch and I think I'm going to try the Tunisian again, but I think I'm going to try it with a bigger hook. I think I'm going to go with the 6.0 millimeter. I think this might be a little bit better. So we'll see. So that's what I have for you today on Scrubby Sunday Monday. And uh, hopefully next week I will be on Scrubby Sunday. <laughs> um, so uh, that is that on that. Please help and donate to this wonderful organization. I think it's amazing. And um, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I'll hook up with you later. Bye.